Today, we're doing a Minecraft mob battle. But what my friend doesn't know is that I cheated. With this item in my hand, I can not only turn myself big and small, but I can do it to other mobs too. All right, let's go see what Denny's doing. D Denny? I am the Grim Reaper. I'm taking all these people's souls. Is that the Grim Reaper? Well, I guess he did just say that, but wh why are you doing this? Look at these poor defenseless souls. Who is Paul? Don't hurt Paul. Oh. Paul didn't deserve to be here. If you know what he did, then you would kill him too. What'd he do? He... Actually, I don't remember. Well, uh, I'm gonna get to the mob battle. Uh, but, uh, yeah, I guess I'll see you then. All right, just don't touch my gazelles on your way over. Oh, and it looks like the first mob that Denny's spawning is these... Whoa, really overpowered, like, half wolf, half, like, golem looking things. That's... These are insane. I think I know exactly how to counter them, though. If I just place down these iron golems, you're probably thinking, oh, they're just a bunch of regular iron golems. Well, if you didn't tell from the start of the video, I've got this shrink ray right here, which I can use to enlarge whatever I want just like this. Wow, look at that. And then if I just left click them like this, oh my gosh, they're massive. Their damage is going to be insane. Make a couple more big ones like that. Oh my gosh, this mod is so cool. All right, just gonna add a couple more. Oh, man. You guys have been to the gym. I can tell the work ethic is insane for you guys. We're gonna have a little guy right there. Let's hope he survives till the end. All right, let's go see what Denny's doing. And he's building a random little building. Hmm. I've got an idea to troll him. Using the shrink ray, I can set it so whatever I touch turns really, really small. So I'm gonna make all his mobs go so small you can barely see them. All right, so I'm just finishing building up my werewolf and I think it looks really cool and it's actually a very good statue for all my werewolves right here. My little family werewolves. Oh, I love you guys so much. Oh, huh, so it does look like he actually does have some werewolves. I guess that was what he spawned. But anyways, I'm gonna go invisible just like this. Go over to his werewolves and make them super small. Hopefully Denny doesn't find out. Oh my gosh, look how small they are. All right, I'm only gonna do these for a couple just so it seems legit, all right? Okay, we're gonna leave those too big. Oh my gosh, they're so small and weak. All right, I'm going back over. Oh, you guys like the statue, my werewolves? And where are they in... Oh my gosh, why are they so small? What happened to them? Then he has no idea what happened to his mobs, but I guess it's time to start the first round. See how he reacts to my massive golems. All right, Denny, are you ready to start the first round? Uh, yeah, I think I am, but my mobs turned really small for some reason. I think some weird visual glitch happened with them. Yeah, those werewolves don't seem very uh, big anymore. I mean, uh... Uh, how do you know what size they are um you told me they were small uh yeah but you said it in a way that made it seem like you could almost see them but that's impossible because this is a bedrock wall oh sorry about that. i just i could just hear the uh, growls you know and the mini growls you know like they you know the, of, of like really small werewolves i thought they were babies at first but you know I, we don't have that in this mod pack so I, I just assumed you know what that's a good excuse and i'm gonna let you off the hook this time although the way you're acting is kind of suspicious so i I'm gonna keep my eye on you. Okay, thanks, Denny. Uh, anyways, I'm gonna put down the wall now in three, two, one. And just and like the battle's that, begun. Oh, wait. And, oh my gosh. The small one's already going at the medium one and, and it's losing just like that. Oh what are these? Gosh. Giant iron golems? How did you get these? Well, that's a secret. If you look up giant iron golems, maybe you'll uh, find it on the internet and maybe buy one from like eBay or something. Thing. I don't know. These aren't iron golems. These are iron giants. Uh, that's a good movie, but no, th these are these are average size. I'd say they're not very big. This is so weird. I looked in the creative inventory for a while and I couldn't find anything like this. So I don't know how you got them to be this big. Oh, I think you just need to be better. Oh, wait, the little ones attacking. Wait, the big ones are attacking my own golem. Wait, this is not good. Oh, it looks like oh, my guys are wait. swarming up on your little guy right here. And oh my God, they're going to destroy him. My own golem's going kind of crazy. The iron golem's doing so much damage, but... Wait, it looks like your werewolves are moving. Oh, and like that, look, all these mobs are getting crazy. They're about to attack the 
the big werewolves, but oh, my iron golems are way bigger. I don't think you're taking this one home, Denny. Oh my gosh, it's a war zone. I think my werewolves can still win, Doga. Oh, uh, we'll no, see one about of them that. just passed away. Oh, this one's picking the wrong fight, and it's down. Here we go. No. What are you going to do against this massive iron golem? You have one I more only, left. I only have one left, and you still have a whole army, but my guy has a lot of willpower, and I believe he can still win. Go, 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 go. I mean, with a build like that, I don't I don't know what you're going to get done here. Sorry, Denny. Are you insulting my build? It's better than having no build at all. Uh, couldn't fit a build over my uh, massive army, which just won the mob battle. No! Sorry about that, Denny. I guess we have to move to the next round. Okay, fine, but you're not winning this next one. Looking at Denny's side again, we're going to see what he's going to spawn and what we could possibly shrink. Oh, my gosh. I think he's spawning a really overpowered mob. He must have been really really annoyed from last round. Whoa. These things are really cool, but I mean, when they're pretty small, I don't think they'll be very cool anymore. So I'm gonna spawn something pretty overpowered and make it massive. Now we only do need to spawn a couple of these, but oh my gosh, look at that. These mobs look insane. Let me just go on survival to see how powerful they are real quick. All right. Oh my gosh, they already did all my damage. Oh, just like that, I'm dead. Since these guys are pretty overpowered now, they're definitely going to be so much more overpowered once I make them bigger. Just going to up the scale like this to the max, hit them with it, and oh my gosh, look how big this mob is. It is almost half the size of the stadium. All right, I'm going to do it for a couple more. Oh. Oh, whoops. I think I made myself a bit too big. Uh, let me just go to regular size and make this guy massive real quick. And look at that. My mobs are so big. We got the regular size ones as well. And I think, you know, just, just for a bit of personality in the mob army, we're going to spawn one more here. And we're going to make it a little bit small. See what this little guy can do. All right. I think we got our mobs ready. Let's go see what Danny's doing. All right. It does look like he's looking away. But uh, I think we might troll him. Okay, so I'm actually building a giant version of one of my mobs. I think it looks really cool. We have that white teeth right here. We can even go inside his mouth. And I plan on putting a little living room in here. It's just going to look really cool. And I'm proud of how it's turning out. A living room? Are you serious? All right, I'm going to quickly make his mobs a little bit small. And then I might place a bit of TNT inside of his mouth. All right, I am now in invisibility and i'm gonna go over to his base real quick make all his mobs small okay okay oh my gosh they look so puny and i'm gonna go over here wait for him to look away i love how big and menacing my mobs are my statue looks exactly like them and what in the world happened to my mobs they're so small now they were so enormous before but now they look like nothing oh and what happened to my statue? I looked away for two seconds and it's all the way in the air now. What in the world? I guess that's what happens when you use the Heaven's Gate <laughs> TNT. I can't believe this. My guy's afraid of heights, so being up here is an absolute nightmare for him. All right, Denny, are you ready? Yeah, I was. And then suddenly a bunch of weird stuff started happening to my side. My mobs got smaller and my build got sent sky high. Oh, that's super weird because my mobs got really small. Yeah, I don't think your fiery mobs are gonna be able to defeat mine. We'll see about that. Wait a minute. How did you know my mobs were fire-based? Uh, nothing. Okay, I'm gonna put down the wall now. Let's go. Okay, wall's going down in three, two, one. Let's go. Oh my what gosh. in the world are these things? They look like giant bugs. The guys are so small. There's no way they're winning this because my guys are overpowered. No, my guys are getting destroyed. One of them just fed the dust. Oh my god! Oh, that guy's getting destroyed as well. They're so small and puny. Why would you choose such a weak mob? I did it. They were massive and large before, but something happened. Yeah, I don't know about that. Looking at your mobs now, it looks like they're born this size. How come your mobs are so so huge and mine got so small. It's weird. I, mean, I don't think this is supposed to be happening. They're pretty average, I, I think. No, I looked in the creative menu and there was not a mob this big. Something weird is going on, Doga. All right, well, you got one guy left. Let's see what he can do. Come on, guy, get in the fight. Get in the fight. I think he can still win. Oh, the last fight has started. Oh, my gosh. And it looks like you guys are about to go down in three, two, one. Oh. No, I can't believe I... Wait a minute. Why is there a normal size one right here? 
Um, that one's actually smaller than usual. I think these two big ones uh made a baby and got this one. All right, uh, Danny. I'll see you the next round where I'm gonna win. Uh, okay, Doga, but you're acting a bit suspicious. Yeah, I don't think I am. All right, I'll see you next round, Denny. Bye, 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 bye. Looking at Denny here, I'm not sure what he's doing, but oh my gosh, look at those mobs. They've got massive sharp swords. I don't know if I can win this round, but I do have an idea for a mob that could beat it. We look right here. I've instantly already have this egg in my inventory because I already knew these guys were gonna be overpowered. Look at those teeth. Look at them in general. Like, come on. The red, the orange, the brown. Oh my gosh, it makes these guys look so much cooler, but you know, I think they're a bit too big. I think they need to be a bit cuter, because smaller better, right? Right, guys? If we just go over here, we can make them super duper small, just like this, and then we can add a couple more. By a couple, I mean a lot more, and also make them small, so that these guys can bite Denny's mob's toes, because they really like toes. It's really weird. Anyways, what is Denny building? All right, I'm going to build a giant version of one of my gators because I think they look really cool. And I'm just going to draw my legs right here. Yo, okay. One of them is a bit longer than the other, but it's okay because we accept all shapes and sizes on this channel. It's true. All right. But yeah, it does look like his alligators are being built by Denny. I don't know. Like, uh, I don't know if he's going to pull it off with that. It kind of looks like he's building half of Kermit the Frog. Anyways, I think it's now fitting that I build myself a little, a little something something. Thing. Wait, Brody is still up there? The guy that I sent to heaven? All right, I guess I guess we didn't clean that up. Anyways, I'm gonna build it up now. It looks like we need some, ooh, gray, gray blocks. We need gray, orange, brown, and red. Gray, orange, brown, red. So we're gonna get four of these swords and set them all to different colors. Now, starting off with the gray wool, we're gonna make a bit of a, kind of like the legs of the thing or whatever you call it. We're gonna call them doggos. I like dogs. Uh, uh, it kind of looks like we go with the orange a bit here at the front. It kind of goes around like this. Just like the top body here. All right, that does look pretty good. I'm gonna look at you a little bit more. Hmm, got the brown at the back. All right, the shape of it is actually kind of coming along better than I thought. We look at you again. All right, so this, here's the front. So we're gonna do a bit of red, of course. And that looks pretty good so far. I'm gonna look at you a little bit more. I know I've kind of looked at you a little bit. Please don't get freaked out. I'm just, I'm just your inventor, your creator, your master. All right, let's. Let's look a little more. They got a tail. How could I forget about the tail? All right, just like that. And then got to add some light gray hints to it, just like this, because that's what the panther looks like, the doggo, the whatever you want to call it. All right, we're going to do this. Okay, break this looking thing here. Build the gray around it a little bit, just like this. That's awesome. That is so good. All right, build it around like this. Awesome, like this as well. And then what does the under part look like? Ooh, a bit of white. We have a bit of white wool at the bottom here. And then what I think we can do for the mouth really quickly, because the round's about to start. And oh my gosh, what is that thing? It actually doesn't look terrible. Terrible, but I mean compared to mine like look at that guys that is actually so much better than I thought and the The face kind of looks like a Pokemon ball. I like Pokemon comment down below if you like Pokemon or Choo Choo Charles I really want to know. All right going over here got a bit of a mouth going. Oh gonna fix that up really quickly That does not look good cut just gonna gotta break this using the shrink thing to break it I know it's a bit risky because I don't want to shrink it already and add some teeth yeah, my build is so much better than Denny's. All right, that's pretty fitting. I think they need some eyes, so I'm gonna give them that and that. It's not a monstrosity, guys, if you really believe it. Gotta think of the personality here. Anyways, I think I'm ready to put down the wall. Denny, are you ready? Yes, I'm ready, Doga. And thankfully, none of my mobs turn small this time. Oh, that's awesome. That means you probably have a chance this time. Not really. Little does he know. I've got so many mobs. All right, I'm gonna put down the wall in three, two, and one. Let's go. There they go. The fighting has started. And what are these guys? They look kind of small and strippy. Funny you say that, Denny, because you better eat those words. What do you mean? Oh, I accidentally made one of your guys really big. Whoa, wait. One of my guys and one of your guys just turned extremely big all of a sudden. What is going on? Oh, bet you did not expect that. That's crazy. Wait, wait they got minute. bigger. And you did that. No. Yes, you did did is it how, give me one reason uh, why i shouldn't believe that you weren't the one that just did that boom. um i'm 
uh, not here. Oh, that's a good excuse. Okay, I'll let you off the hook for now. Yeah, I'll I'll go find. Uh, I'll come out from behind here. All right, go over here. Hey, Denny, what's up? Were you looking for Doga? He's right here. Really? Yeah. No. Wait. Oh, yeah. So is this the guy that made the mob speaker? I think so, because he is pretty big. I mean, look at him. Yeah, you're right. Okay, you're right. I'm sorry for ever suspecting you. Oh, you that's okay. And it looks like I have no moms left. Oh, did we just miss the mob battle because you were sneakily suspicioning me? I'm sorry. My suspicioning will come to a sharp endation. Your build actually looks really, really bad. Are you serious? Even the Pokeball face? Yeah, Pokeball. More like poke me balls because this looks like it can poke my balls. Man, I love Pokeballs as well. All right, I'm ready to start the next round, Denny. I don't know about you, but let's go. I'm ready to start the next round too. All right, see you then. Bye-bye-bye. All bye. All right, for the final round, let's see what Denny's doing. And by the way, whoever wins this round, we kind of just declared that whoever wins, wins the whole thing. And oh my golly gosh, what the flip-flop flap is that? That is insane. Look at it. It is so scary. I would not want to be in the same room as this thing in real life. Thank God this is Minecraft, though, which I think is good. And whoa, they're kind of attacking each other. I hope oh. Den can get that sorted out. Um, After seeing that mob, I think it's big brain time. Just like that, my head's bigger, therefore my mind is bigger, therefore my brain is bigger. And I'm going to spawn some really OP things. Right now, as you can see, there is a lot of mobs. If I just spawn one of them, a bunch of them come out. Now, if I go into survival right now, just like this, I'm pretty sure they attack me. Oh my gosh, they're all ganging up on me. There is so many of them. There is like, they're like little ants. Thank God I'm smart enough to go into creative. So I do oh my gosh, look at the effects happening. Let me just clear my effects real quick. Just like that with a command, easy peasy. But uh, that's not the final mob I'm using. The real mob, which is going to accompany these mobs is called the Mateus boss. Oh my gosh, look at that thing. Now, just to top it off, I'm going to right click this thing. And as you can see, you can't really see the number in the middle, but this is at max height, meaning this massive mob here is going to become five times bigger in three, two, one now. And oh my gosh, when I look at a certain angle, I can't even see it. But look how massive it is. Holy crap. I'm trying to get a good shot in it, guys. But oh my gosh, look at this thing. I'm pretty sure Dan can already see it over the wall. What in the world is that thing? Uh, what thing? It's you can't huge. You can't see over the wall. I, uh, I'm trying to get a good angle on it, but I, I can barely see it. Oh my god, it's so big. All right, I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm ready to put down the wall, Danny. Are you? Mm. One sec, I'm eating my steak. Oh, okay, I'll wait. All right, your guys are ready. My guys are ready. All right, and we've got our massive boss right here. The wall's going down in three, two, one, now. What in the world is that? This is Mateus, but five times bigger. Five times bigger? Wait, so you're the one making all these mobs different sizes? Uh, no. But uh, at least at least Brody has a friend now. You know, your last build from the first round. Oh, yeah, he does. Yeah, so, you know, maybe there's an upside to me changing all the sizes. I mean, I didn't do that. Oh, my gosh, look at these little guys. Oh, my gosh, your guys are about to kill my little guys, but the little guys isn't the problem. I think your, your biggest problem is Mateus. Okay, my guys are kind of hitting Mateus, and uh, it's not doing any damage him. Oh, that's a big shame. Look at him doing his attacks. That's insane. How is he so powerful? Where did you find this mob? Uh, the internet. This time I used Amazon. You know, I thought I'd uh, switch providers instead of email this eBay this time. So, uh, yeah, that's my excuse. Yeah, eBay is pretty bad. Yeah, I, I asked for a puppy and I got this. So, uh, yeah, I, I guess I'll just be happy with what I've got. All right, looking at this, it kind of looks like, uh, I defeated a lot of your mobs. No. Oh, it looks like this guy's big too. Okay, I have no choice but to use my secret weapon. Your secret weapon? What do you mean your secret weapon? You, all your mobs are dead. There's there's no secret weapon. Not yet, they're not. They're not dead because they're in here. Wait, is that what I think it is? Is that the death ray? Well, I better destroy it real quick. Oh, I missed. Wait, no. No way me missing just ended the world. Oh, the death no. Death ray is lighting. There's nothing you can do, Doga. Get ready to feel it's wrap. I don't know if my little guys, especially Mateus, will win this. Oh no, you gotta survive the death ray, Mateus, please! Oh, it's getting louder, it's getting louder! No! Oh! 
Oh my god, there's nothing but bedrock left. Wait, Mateus survived. I think that means I win the mob battle. Huh. No way! How did you guys survive? Hey, I mean, look at Brody. He's He's got, like, rocket boots now. That's kind of cool. Oh, my gosh. Well, at least Brody is safe, too. Yeah, I mean, he's kind of sitting in lava right now, but... Yeah, I guess he's safe. Okay, let's end the video inside Brody's mouth because I love going in people's mouths. Me too, Denny. Thank you, everyone, for watching. Please be sure to like and subscribe. This was Dogger. And I'm Denny. And we're done. Bye. Like and subscribe. And comment down below which mob you like the most. Bye-bye-bye-bye-bye-bye.